Neighbors in Allentown fed up over an increase in tractor trailer volume through their neighborhoods now have the city's attention. We first told you about this issue on Monday and since then cars have been totaled. NBC 10 Stephen Fisher got answers as to how this problem started and neighbors tell him why it needs to stop now. It totaled it. Wow, look at that. This video shows the damage a tractor trailer did to an Allentown resident's car, and it's not the first time. Here's another video showing a tractor trailer hitting neighbor Jason Delon's car while trying to navigate a turn. This car is totaled now. Car's totaled. It's not, I didn't get to drive it. I can't drive it. This is the whole door, quarter panel, trunk. Jason's car was parked legally, and while being without a car is bad enough, he's hoping this problem doesn't get worse. It's terrible. It's not something that should be in these roads because I have nieces and nephews that play around here, and these trucks, they're not going down the street. Like, they're not going down the street at 15 miles per hour. They're upwards of 40. Neighbors couldn't help but notice these tractor trailer trucks coming through their town starting back in late June. They say it's a safety hazard. They also say they don't belong here. You know what? They're right. According to the city, this area not permitted for this type of activity. After NBC 10 brought neighbors concerns to the city of Allentown, the city said, quote, we now believe the property is being used as a trucking terminal as defined in the city of Allentown zoning ordinance, which is not permitted in a B5 zone. Buildings are like pretty old, right? So once they strike the road faster, all the, the, the buildings like start shaking up. The trucks are coming and going from a facility near Bucky Boyle Park where the trucks are housed. Neighbors say the constant noise damage and danger over the last month has lasted a month too long. Of course it's dangerous. A lot of accidents are going on nowadays just because of those trucks. I basically want the peace as it used to be uh, like a month ago. The city also told me they have been in contact with the property owners and are actively working towards addressing this problem. Meanwhile, to help their own cause, neighbors plan on presenting a signed petition to city council tonight at their meeting. In Allentown, Stephen Fisher, NBC 10 News.